Hello everyone, this is the Howling Wolf. Here gonna give you my selections for February 21st, 2019. But before I do that, I wanna tell you to please subscribe so you can see more of my videos that come up. And also, if you guys like to follow me on Twitter, you can, it is on at Howler92. Where I put most of my picks on there that I don't do videos for. Now, for the track that I'm gonna do for you. The track that I'm going to do for you, it is going to be the fairgrounds. It is going to be race number 7, going a mile and 70 yards on the dirt for allowance optional claiming $17,500. We got a field of round 9 with the, the ones are entries, so it would be 8. It was a pretty difficult field. A lot of these horses ran against each other. And they've been playing the merry-go-round race most of the time. Uh, I'm going to be giving you my two top selections and possibly even my price horse. My top selection is going to be Tough Kid by Don't Be Mad out of a Wild Again Mare. Tough Kid ran last time on January 25th. Uh, allowance 44000 at Delta Downs. Just was too, I think that was just too rough of a field for Tough Kid to run in. But shows that it has the good speed and comes up late good. The time before that it ran at Remington Park for allowance optional claiming 40000 Came in a good fourth. Just failed to run in, but ran up until the, the end of the stretch and got a nice good late kick in to get fourth there. The workouts had been, the times they did good workouts was back in December 20th. It did uh, four furlongs at 48.2 second breezing. And then after that, it did it in January 9th and four furlongs for 48.8 breezing. Again, like I said, I see this horse coming in late. It is getting a new jockey aboard. It's got good average speed and should have a great finishing kick in this class level. It should be able to show the ability that this horse has. So again, for my top selection, it is the number four tough kid at eight to one morning line odds. My second choice, it is gonna be the number six, Aces High. Aces High is by Flower Alley out of a charismatic mare. Ran last time at this distance at mile seventy yards at the fairgrounds on a fast track. Came in a good second. It had to go two to three wide on the turn and fought on gamely because it was up there for the pace. It was a pace setter going up there first. Just got too tired out but fought on a good race at the distance and at the same level. Uh, the time before that it ran on a sloppy track at the at a mile and one sixteenth distance on the same type of level. Came in a good second, but had Miguel Mena aboard. Had to go four wide in the turn. Just went six wide in the quarter turn and was just out finishing, tired out. So it tried a different tactic from that race. It tried a different tactic than the last race. It tried to be the pace setter and it just didn't work. So in between there, you may see either that horse try to either find its level to run in. It also has got James Graham aboard. James Graham is at least 10%. <clears throat> Excuse me. So you may see this one coming up a good late. Try it in between. Try to stay between because there's a lot more faster horses than... Then ace is high. So you're going to have to see this one lay back on. Try to hold on tight for at least a good fight. 
and instead of trying to fight on, we'll try to get up there to get the win. So again, for my second choice, it is Aces High at three to one. For my price horse, I'm gonna be going with the number three, California Swing. California Swing is by Malibu Moon out of a Dino Former Mare. The Brit pedigree reads distance, this type of distance. It has won two out of the three races around this level, this this distance, and even shorter. It is getting Ty, Ty Kennedy aboard, which won the last time out aboard this horse at the same level here at Go um, the fairgrounds. So notice how they get this horse into position. Running a good late kick again down the stretch, showing that right near the wire you should get the win. So again, for my price horse, it is to be the number three California swing at the morning line odds at five to one. So you may see that one go up or go down. If you guys like to hear some more of my selections, just stay on and please subscribe again. And follow me on Twitter at Howler92. You'll see a lot of my selections that I do for most of the tracks there. And remember, when you're catching with the wolf, it's howling time. Good luck, everybody, and let's make that money.